Hey guys, welcome to another server minor plugin tutorial. I'm your host LTGM007 and today we're looking at the Combat Weaponry Plus. So you can see a few items that I've got in my inventory at the moment. We've got some lovely emerald gear. So we've got an emerald scythe, a rapier, some emerald armor, a spear, hoe, and there's plenty of other ones. So this is a pretty neat plugin which adds loads more weapons to your Minecraft server and as you can see it comes with a custom texture pack that should download automatically. So if you want to make sure the texture pack downloads make sure you have this enabled and then if we join the game you should see it download the moment you join and then you should get all the nice textures that you can see here. Now there are no commands with this plugin but if we go into a crafting bench and then use the recipe book we can see there's a few more pages than normal and if we filter through them you can see some new items so here are some of the emerald gear. We've also got a gold katana and if you were to click on one it will show you how you craft it and then we can filter through a bit more and you can see we've got a repeating crossbow, some more rapiers, a saber, that's pretty awesome. So you can see there are plenty Plenty of different weapons brand new to the game so if we spawn a couple of spiders be our victims you can see you know they act like typical weapons doing various different damage uh, depending if they're wearing armor or um, whatever it says in the lore now one note the developer makes regarding the armor is if you put it on it's not actually going to be emerald it's gonna be gold if you want the emerald texture for that, they mentioned that you can use Optifine to get the emerald color. So that is a quick look at what it looks like in-game. Let's head over to the config file and see what we can change in there. So here we are in the SMPitnik control panel. You can see there's a single config.yml. And if we look at the top, you can set the language. You can even do a custom resource pack if you wanted. I think the current one's pretty good, but if you wanted, you could put a new URL here. And if we scroll down a bit, we've got all the different types of armor. So you can see there, are an absolute ton of new weapons and armor that you can enable or disable depending if you do not like them and as you can see there are a few things that are disabled such as the really good sword which is a joke item apparently and then some experimental items and then we've got enchanting down here that you can set for various gear such as the emerald gear then we have the multiplier for all the weapons so if you wanted to make them a little bit more powerful you could adjust those numbers and then we have all of the armor down here the various armor ratings and any bonus health they give so pretty simple to customize you can change various damages and numbers to make them a bit more powerful here we are on this bigger page you can see it's updated from 1.20 to 1.21 uh, this is a port of a previous plugin which was abandoned and as you can see there is a good amount of information here these are all the weapons in this nice gif and then here is some more information about some of the various weapons that we looked at so if you want to download it, head over to the Spigot page. But if you need a server to host it on, check out serverminer.com for the best and cheapest hosting around. That's it for me. Subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you next time.